Don't cross the streams. Video streams, that is. Streaming is a great way to interact with your viewers in real time, and today, Brittany invites you to have a discussion with her about using live streaming along with your YouTube channel. Hello, Freedom Family. Today, I wanted to do something a little bit different than just share a game review with you. I wanted to have more of a discussion with you and to allow you guys to have a discussion amongst yourselves in the comments below. Now, today's topic is going to be over live streaming. And while I'm not going to be talking about any one service in particular, today's topic is just going to be a broad one. Now I am going to reference Twitch because that is what I use, but you can also check out Hitbox, which is another service that some of my other friends use, and I'm sure there's probably some other ones that are just as good too. Now, today I'm going to share my thoughts and my feelings and my personal opinions on using live streaming along with your YouTube channel. I have thought up three points that I think are pretty good conversations starters so I'm going to talk about those and share my opinions with you point one streaming sites can help you become searchable which can help your YouTube audience grow when you stream on twitch for example you are searchable on the main site while you are live yes you're somewhat searchable on YouTube but on streaming sites it allows you to search for who is live now and by which particular game that you're wanting to watch. So this gives you way more opportunity for exposure and for people to actually find your content. So once you gather that audience and people who decide that they like you and want to stick around, you can redirect them back to your YouTube channel where they can find more of you when you're not streaming. I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty sure that my tiny little YouTube channel has never been featured on the YouTube site. So it sounds pretty good to me to be featured while I'm live streaming. <laughs> Point two, streaming is is a little different than making a YouTube video. I'm sure that most of you know this, but being live right then and there can make a world of a difference. It's really easy to chop down a half hour recording into a five minute super fast paced, really awesome video, but when you stream, the viewer sees everything. Does that make you guys nervous? It makes me nervous. <laughs> Or how do you guys handle the difference? I haven't been streaming very much lately, but when I do, it always makes me nervous because there's no pause button. If something happens, everyone's gonna see it. There has been a lot of behind the scenes actions in my streams because there is no pause button. Point three, streaming allows you to engage with your audience in a better way. I say better in a biased way because I personally think that it's better to be present with your audience at that time. I feel like having them see me in real time lets me know them a little bit differently and a little bit better. You can answer questions and respond to them directly as well as goof off and have fun. How do you guys feel about live interactions versus just interacting in the comments? I could go on and on about this topic, but like I said earlier, I want this to be a discussion. This is not the opportunity to just spam the comments, that's not what the goal is here, but instead use this opportunity to chat with other creators and potentially find some new friends. You can find people that are totally similar to you and your style, or find people who are totally different who offer a fresh new perspective that you never thought of. If this type of video works out well and you guys do end up liking it, I can continue doing discussion videos and engage you guys in conversations. Leave me some comments down below letting me know any other type of discussions that you might like to have with me. Or if you're not into this type of video, just leave some games that you'd like for me to review like always. Remember, no spamming your channel. This is an opportunity to chat. So if that is all that happens, this type of video will not happen ever again. Thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy this, you can find more of me on my channel Brits Games. I will be responding to your comments with that channel as well as it'll be in the description box, like always. That's not spamming, that's just me discussing me with you. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the comments. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next week. Goodbye! Hello everyone, and welcome to Life is Strange episode two. I'm so excited to start this episode. I keep seeing everyone's videos pop up, and I have not started it yet. It's driving me crazy. So we're starting it today. I love how different it looks. I'm so excited. We are starting off in the girls' dormitory, so we're back at Blackwell Academy. Impulse is produced by the Freedom Network. Ever wanted to earn revenue from your videos? Freedom offers a great partnership program which includes access to hundreds of thousands of audio tracks, sponsorships with great partners, and most importantly, a no lock-in contract. You can leave at any time for any reason. We accept everyone, both big and small. For more information, click here or visit the link in the video description.